Okay, so here's the thing. Uh, Poppy Playtime. Uh, I'm... I don't know, maybe my things will, uh, clock out at me at some point, I don't know. But, yeah, we're playing Poppy Playtime today. Uh, we got Poppy play, play we got Chapter 3 coming on the 30th of, uh, this month. Uh, January. Just to be, just to clarify, just in case, uh, you know, reasons, but whatever. So don't forget to hit that like button and also subscribe so we can reach 25 subscribers. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So this is chapter one of Poppy Playtime. This is the original chapter, the first one. So here we go. Yeah, that's good. Okay. All right. Chapter one. All right, chapter one. A tight squeeze. Let me pull myself back up now. All right. Uh, an ex as an ex-employee of Playtime Co., you finally returned to the factory many years after nobody within... Many years after everybody within disappears. How interesting. There is new load. Yeah, new load. Main menu. Yep. Okay, let's go. I played this a long time ago, so I pretty much know how it, how it works. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Oh Her my god. Poppy. Poppy! And she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. Right. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. <laughs> Hard to believe. Just watch. Just watch. Poppy Playtime! Poppy's Sweet. as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love Happy. you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect! <laughs> Thank you. Her hair nice. is dirty and won't come out when you brush it. And smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything <laughs> else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Playtime! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just two ninety nine dollars a person. An entire hour and the most magical toys... An entire hour? Are. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can Oh. Okay, well. The poppy flower. Interesting. Poppy playtime. All right, everything thinks everyone thinks the staff disappeared 10 years ago you're still here find the flower vintage poppy commercial oh okay so that's what came in the mail huh? interesting okay so i shouldn't have too much issue with the uh with with the motion detector motion thing because uh i think last time before i wasn't able to uh Make it full screen, maybe. I think I'm not 100 percent sure, but uh, let's watch this tape. Oh, press E to use to do that. Okay. TV time. Hi, my name is Late Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. <laughs> if you're seeing this. A wuggy, huggy wuggy. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, right. this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more <laughs> tame aspects of our security system no spoilers so you've got my warning it's not too late to turn around 
I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Oh, because the tape is done. Good. I heard, I saw before on other videos, the, uh, the ones where they can, like, no clip into the, like, walls and all that. But apparently, the outside that you never get to see, ever, uh, is decorated and all that, too. And, and it's the same for the uh, security breach. You never see the outside, uh, unless it's, like, a, a certain uh, ending cutscene. But, yeah. I don't know why they did that. It's just probably just for the uh, aesthetic or something. I don't know. But it is what it is. Okay, so the train is the code, by the way, but... The train is for the keypad code over there. It's... What is it? Oh, it's a uh, green, pink, yellow, red. Green, pink, yellow, red. Okay. And I think it's the same for each time. Oh, man, that's gotta be annoying. Yeah, I know. Green, pink, yellow, red. Like I've said before, I have played this before, so I know all the ins and outs. Somewhat. Not all of them, but some of them. Uh, like, they, you know, all of these freaking computers are, jeez. I wonder why all these computers have the same picture. How weird. Crazy. Oh, cool. They inputted a a skip button. Oh, so my so there is going to be an issue here. Oh, my face cam is going to be a real issue sometimes. Bing, 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 bing. Cool. Okay. Oh, I forgot about the crouch button. I'm gonna try and get through as this as quickly as possible. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Alright. Okay, retract it, please. Jeez. So, it seems like there's been some uh, updates to the uh, the first game. Where it's... You get that skip button, you get the uh, info on in the bottom corner instead of the top left. The top corner, sorry. So... Hmm. figured as much. Thanks, buddy. High five. <laughs> oh, the power room. Right, okay. Gotcha. Power room. Staff only. Pretty much a staff, because I used to work here before, apparently. And it's not that far off where they have worked here before. It's kind of dark in here. It's a little dark in here. Thanks for slamming the door. God, I was so freaking loud. All right. Can I do this again? Oh, that's right. 
people are last time I played this before I didn't know about this claw I probably didn't see it before I was just too focused on doing the game itself but uh when people played this for the first time people were uh theorizing that this is the uh, the prototype claw that did this I don't know if it still is but it is what it is Oh. Right. Oh, that's right, tight up here. Okay, don't really need that one because it's barred it off and I don't have a second hand. Okay. Oh god, Bob. Oh god, okay. I think it still goes. No, stop. So what's the off-brand one? I know there was an off-brand one here somewhere. And I hate that fucking goddamn that thing was gonna kill me at some point. Oh there it is. There's that demented one. <laughs> Alright. All right, I have to keep it on. Make a friend. Oh, thank goodness. I thought I'd never see that. Oh, I saw you, Eggie. And this mouse thing is really going to get my nerves. Okay, I think I remember doing the uh, orange tape somewhere, so I'll go get that. Huggy is there. Okay, where was this orange tape? I know it was here somewhere. Nope. Okay. <laughs> I see you. Now where is this orange tape? Oh no. Oh, Jesus. I did that freaking mouse sense non-registering thing is gonna kill me. Mess with me. <laughs> I really wanna look for this tape though. Before I uh, sent them all off, I'm going to try and look for this tape. <laughs> 
Where is that orange tape, actually? Oh, there it is. Trying to hide from me? You can't do that, man. You can't hide from me. Nothing can hide from me. Nothing can hide from me. Rich, where are they keeping the huggy boxes? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Remember when maintenance left in a sweep of this place? No. Exactly. Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. <laughs> I get it. It's a nice program and all on brand. But, uh, it's just hard to be happy about it when manufacturing's on our neck about it because we can't buy stupid hockey boxes. Rich. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're right. You're right. It's it's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. Anything less would be more habitable. Is is that even a word? Habitable. Who knows? <laughs> I don't think it really matters anymore. All right, let's go see Huggy in that little corner now. There you are, I saw you, you little shit. <laughs> I saw Huggy in that vent there. Like I didn't see him. I gotta go down, huh? Got... Good thing I've got that orange tape. Took me a little while to figure that out. And got him. Cool. Oh, I gotta crouch. Uh... We okay. the circuit type shit. Man, I really can't see shit here. Okay. Through here. Got it. All right. Cool. Okay. <laughs> that happened. I want to do all of chapter one. I don't want to, like, keep, like... I'm going to try and do all of chapter one. I just wish the, uh, the mouse thing wasn't such an issue. Needs power. Oh, yeah, um... Oh, up there. Right, that's right. Uh, the mouse sensitivity thing is just... I mean, not sensitivity, the mouse rearranged thing. When you have, like, something else on the... covering it, it just doesn't... do anything. Oh, right, I think, like... Pretty sure it was right here in the corner. Right 
right there. All right, let's go watch this tape. So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go yeah, straight I bet it was. from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. It was such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide <laughs> kids with that same experience, that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, because adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older and older. Yeah. And then you die. And then you die. <laughs> Human bodies just Oof. can't stay young forever. There's things, though. Like some trees that can stay alive even while being way older than a person. I mean, <laughs> the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something. Right? Sure. Right, I think we're getting a little off track. Uh, I think she's kind of losing her mind there. <laughs> right, I gotta turn this power on now. Okay, Let's see if I can actually do this. I really don't understand this one too much. Hmm. Unless it's over the first one, the this one first, and then the other one. Stop. Got it. Okay. There's go the electricity. All right, I could just drop down, but I really don't want to do that. <laughs> oh my god, the fucking! Why did they? They fix everything else, but why can't they? They fix the mouse thing. Make the mouse intangible, you know? Okay, so I have to go like this. Because it's borderline. And, uh... You think, put this game out for so long, you think it'd be uh, eligible to do a uh, controller, but... It doesn't seem like it. It would make the game a little more easier to play. But... I don't think that's what you're going for. Uh... Boop. It's 1960. 1960. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah, I see you. Big red one looking at me. Uh, okay, so I gave it color. Assembled it. <laughs> Just only one bound. Okay. And then I guess it gave it structure? I'm not sure what the last one does. Alright, this last bit here is gonna be the most annoying. Uh, 
I don't think it wants me to grab it. Okay. Grab it with the hand, not the, uh... E. Okay. So this is gonna be the most annoying part. I don't know why you hear the Finance of Freddy's uh, theme song every time. Like, ding, 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 ding. That's what I hear every time I play this. Get to this part. I don't know why. Are you serious? Are you stuck? How do you get stuck? I got stuck in the corner. Yeah, he's wonderful, all right. He's killing me to death, but hey, he's wonderful. Mm. Okay, so I was like, that was just a spot off there. Turn, turn. Do not get stuck here again. I don't want to go through this several more times. <laughs> oh, right. Uh... Why am I going so slow? got through it I didn't realize I had to go like the other Can... mouse please I swear you know what I'm just gonna go through it as quickly as possible I don't do the LCD yet not up here it's up up stupid mouse I hate this mouse I see the blood on the pipe. <laughs> okay, I don't really need to, uh... There's the tape. There's the TV. Alright, uh, I got through it. Alright, I got through it. Let's watch the dang TV. Final log in relation. Experiment. One zero zero six, the prototype. Coordination okay. and cooperation is evidently within his skill set, as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Though still missing, today's events are no doubt in relation the to claw. his absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. That's why I'm making this log, so that okay. the same mistake won't be made twice. Future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough and I'll be back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not. End of... <laughs> he didn't get to finish his sentence. <laughs> God, I swear to freaking... Damn things. One of the uh, arrow keys, not the arrow keys, but you never understand what, how to like locate my hands for the WASD's keys, and it's it probably what was killing me a few times there too because I had to move over, I had to pull my mouse pull off my mouse, go to the control, duck down at a certain level. It was like where I had to like crouch down and look at the same time because you can't see it when you're like. Right here, and you can't see that hole that's on the bottom of the 
the, that vent thing. So we have a bunch of, we got a couple, uh, uh, cappies, uh, the Dougie Bot and a Brawn with no leg and no foot. Uh, no limb on one side. Candy Cat and no limbs on either backside. Uh, another Candy Cat with no limbs at all. And then, uh, a Bucky Bot. Which probably doesn't have only one rear? One Rotar? Yeah, Rotom. Yeah, only one Rotom. Okay. Okay, let's go. Let's go free Poppy. I feel like this is different too. I don't feel like it's, it was like this before. Maybe it was, and I just don't remember. Ooh, these are nice pillows. Well, that's a nice pillow, the flowers. And that's the door we go through, I think, in the second one. Okay. Oh, a bunch of new. Ooh, star pillows. I like the star pillows better than the flowers. Mm, that yellow one, though, is good too. All right, so this is a, uh, I don't even know if this is even a secret, it's just a dollhouse. Anything even in it? Not really. That's how dollhouses are made, they have, they have like, no backs. And you literally like uh, sunflowers, don't you? Daffodils. These are poppy walls. Anyways, let's free her. And this. <laughs> Opened my case. Oh, yeah. I sure did. Oh. Chapter one. I tight squeeze. Yeah, that's the end of chapter one. I had a little issue with with uh some parts, but don't worry, I'll cut some of that out. Uh, it shouldn't be too long, I don't think. Chapter one is not that long. Chapter two is a little longer because of the uh mini games, but I'll get to those mini games another time it's gonna be hell for me to get through the uh <laughs> two of those mini games i am not good with the uh memory thing that's not my kind of thing the 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 other ones where i have to like hit the 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 mini uh huggies that's gonna be an issue too and then the the ones for you it's red light green light kind of shit that's gonna be awful as well but other than that, that's pretty much it. So that's the, uh, I guess I can let these cut it, credits roll out, right? Or, I mean, I do, okay, yeah, it's gonna finish, okay. It's nice that they have a little skip button on the bottom there, on the bottom corner, right corner, the bottom right corner, <laughs> it's pretty cool. Poppy Playtime! Yay, the first chapter is done, thank God. All right, it's on to chapter two in the next one, so, don't forget to hit that like button and also subscribe so we can reach 25 subscribers. I'm putting it up. 25 subscribers. That's the next margin we need to get to. That would be wonderful. I love that. And uh, we'll. I guess I'll see you in the next one. So anyways. Bye.